What is going on, everybody? We're back on it for the second to last time. Well, not forever, because chapters will still be coming out, but it's not going to be... I mean, and we'll talk about this with the, the last chapter in the next video, but I've been doing six plus berserk chapters a week for like over the over the last year like it's a like daily life routine at this point i mean when you do something over like two three weeks like that becomes routine we've been doing this for over 52 weeks like it's been it's been crazy and it's just gonna end <laughs> which is absolutely crazy to think but we're back chapter 373 374 decided to split it up like that after um after this, we'll have, uh, we'll just do the one chapter because that's all we have left. And we'll kind of use that as kind of like a, a series recap to talk about things future. Um, and then what I'll plan to do is have a Berserk live stream like we kind of did with the Attack on Titan. Just to talk about it, maybe rank some character because I doubt... I mean, are we going to get any new crazy characters, really, that we can't do, like, a character ranking tier list, at least? Do you think we'll get introduced to anybody that's going to make that big of an impact? Some characters get changed, though, for good or for worse, so we'll, we'll decide what we do with that, but we will be doing a Berserk live stream um, before the year ends. And, uh, I mean, the last couple chapters haven't given me any hope of anything at all, Um it seems so hopeless. It seemed hopeless before, but there was a little bit of promise. Like, like literally, we can't. We sailed through the storm, literally a part of the story, and like the characters in the story, like just getting beat down over and over, never catching a win, never never getting a victory. And by God, we found the island. We restore Casca. She's living life, and things are looking better. We didn't get the moments with her yet, but. You know, we acknowledged each other. She told us, you know, give her time. And it looked like, you know, this could be a life worth living. And it's not like it, like, just went back or, like, Casca's doing worse. She's just been taken. She's gone. And not only is she taken and she's gone, she's taken and she's gone by him. He who must not be named. <laughs> um... And then we tried with essentially all our rage to do something about it. And I don't even know. It was like an ant trying to fight a human, like just not even phased. Um, so Guts is clearly depressed. I don't know what's up with Casca. Like, do they have her? Is she mentally coping in the situation that she's in? Do they have her drugged up or Griffith has her under something? And then what's the plan with her? And to the point, it's to the point where like, I can't even really kind of ask you guys these questions because we're all kind of at the same place right now. So now we're all just going to be asking the same questions, which is weird. Um, I kind of had that same realization when I got caught up with all the Hunter Hunter chapters. It was like, oh, I could ask all these questions, get all these answers. And then all of a sudden I catch up and we're all kind of wondering the same thing. So I don't know. Let's get on it and see how it goes, though. Drag this over here. Make sure you guys can see the cursor. Should be able to. All right. And we're recording. Everything's on. Mic should be crispy. All right. 373. And then how does the Cedro feel? Because he's never seen guts like this before. Just kind of just defeated in. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. We've been looking for you, Isidro. It's dangerous out there, you know? Right, need me for something? Can sh and this is inter hold on. Can Shirka reach beyond on this ship where despair rises? It's interesting, all these like new kind of things they're doing here. In order to ascertain Casca's whereabouts after she was taken, Shirka intends to conduct a magic rite. Magic, huh? In this ritual, she will enter into a deep medit meditative state to expand her consciousness. Raising her power of perception, rather, and then... What are you even saying, man? Expanding consciousness and raising perception? I got no clue about all that. Listen, Isidro, Elf Island is gone. Is this Sir Pico giving him this talk? This is good. This is, hold on now. 
Alphalan is gone, together with the Great Spirit Tree and all the souls it supported. So the Spirit Tree... But wasn't... Weren't there, like, twin... Isn't there, like, two going now? To my understanding? I, I don't even know if I have that correct. Because, again, I don't know how they just vanish. Okay, so... Hold on. The witches lost their home, and many are starting to lose their power. We were lucky to be strangers to the island, and its vanishing had no particular effect on us. Ah. Uh, ain't that swell. So this right here, Elf Island is gone, together with the Great Spirit Tree and all the souls it supported. So the big great tree there, but didn't they say the tree, this the thing that sprouted up over there? The big broccoli sticking out of the earth? <laughs> um, some mob psycho shit. Was it just a, t a twin spirit tree life thing that erupted? Kind of like how they have right now with Griffith? Are they connected at all? So that's where all the, the creatures and the elves went. Um, now, the witches, they weren't supported. By that. They're born of human, maybe? They have no connection. Well, no, I guess life force connection. But their powers are... But Shirka never needed it. So maybe the other witches should be able to... If Shirka can teach them, they won't need whatever that island was provided for their powers, no? Shirka's clearly shown that. Um, but where's Guru Boy in all them? They should still be alive though, right? The elder witches and shit? I don't know. It just seems... I don't know why I'm asking questions. It's all... It's gone. It's all gone. All we can do is trust in Shirka now. We will begin the right. Oh, look. They're right there. What are y'all doing? I don't... Let me not even ask. Because... What do they do? The answer to that question is absolutely nothing. So, let's just keep going. <laughs> Miss Varnish, just in case, please care for my body. Miss, do you really just want us to watch over you? Oh, the, the, the art style has kind of gone back to maybe a little bit what we had before. It's important that everyone's awareness is focused in one place for this right. Even those who have not studied the arcane arts can contribute to magic. I don't get it, but sounds good. So this is a dark art. Hmm. Like, you you see his ass back here, right? Old guru dick boy back here. A any guidance, any words of encouragement, any power boost, any... Any anything that you could bestow upon us before we try this. Any alternative methods, any pointers, anything. <sighs> She's not nodding off, is she? Right now, Master's consciousness is expanding into the realm of the dead, or rather, a domain even deeper beyond. Be quiet. And there she goes, up, up, and away. See ya. Uh, this is the dragon's path. It stretches on without end. Without end, I can manifest my perception beyond the horizon. What is this dense OD gathering in the far distance? As if all odd is flowing toward a single point. Yeah. What do we think that single point is? We'll just take a guess what we think that is. There can only be one such place within the bounds of this world. In there. Surely there. Well. What's he up to? Just going through it. Rage. Is someone, like, checking on him? Can the old wit guru do that, at least? Morta, at least somebody that might be able to, like, subdue us. Like, put a Yamato chakra stamp on our head so the nine tails doesn't come out like can we get anything because this is bad <laughs> we are at our absolute i would say this is our second lowest point ever for guts one was like all that happened with the eclipse but this i think is the second like right there and if his mental is that like in that state right now this thing here could easily take us over and don't you just feel like we didn't get anything from Elf Island? 
no insight on the armor, maybe how to control it. Skull Knight gives us nothing. Danon gives us nothing. The the the, uh, the blacksmith gives us nothing. All we got out of that was turning Casca back, turning Casca's brain back on. Ah, uh, you want it, don't you? Power. Relax, buddy. Relax. Take a deep breath. We already tried this. Remember, it didn't work. It didn't work. What am I looking at? What am I looking at? Is he throwing up? And just fainted. Just passed out. Yeah. yeah. You cannot deny me that brand limits you. You cannot deny me that flesh restrains you. Your flesh, your blood, the creaking of your bones, your pain, even your soul yield them to me you're all why so we can just become skull knight 2.0 skull knight still can't get shit done so what is that gonna do for us if you do uh guys what's this a smoke bomb Oh my god. I wonder, uh, I'm not even going to say Kashan attack because there's no Kashan anymore, right? But are these guys even human? What's up with their eyes? We're really not under, under attack right now. In the open water? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Um... Oh my god. Yo, witches. Do you guys do anything? Yo, Morta, didn't she want, like, to stretch her powers out into the real world and really, like, get into some things? What? How do they even... Bo Bro, they don't even look like human. They look like they're possessed or taken over or something. And our greatest warriors just passed out. Trapped both body and soul, what fate awaits the party? It's in How do you guys feel about these things that they're doing here? These kind of like, find out next time on. Hmm. I mean, it just keeps getting worse. It actually keeps getting worse. I mean, maybe, th maybe this will be Rickard's group that found us or something? Ah. I don't know, maybe the, 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 the witch of theirs, or what are we even calling him? Sorcerer is, I don't know, I'm just trying to look for positives here, but <laughs> where is it? Holy shit, look at Serpico in the, the dripping tin right there. It's actually kind of clean. The green on green right there? Hmm. I don't hate that. Yeah, those are, I mean, they're, they're Kashan ships, but is there, I, I mean, I guess they're still like Kashan people, ethnicities, but isn't everything just sailing under Griffith at the moment? So like, is this a Griffith like naval party that just happened to come across us or given direct orders or not connected with him at all? I don't know. Let's see. Let's give it a look, I guess. Because this looks awful. You know, they're, they're firing on us. They are boarding. Why are they even... Like, look at these waters right now. Why are you out here? <laughs> oh, no. Mm-mm. We're surrounded, too. I I don't know, man. What's that noise? Did Shirka bundle it? Lady Farnese, oh man. Sounds like trouble. To the stateroom below deck. Oh, it looks like we got a fight. With no, we have nothing on us too, by the way. Bro, they don't look human. What is going on here? We've been boarded? Yeah, you don't have a blade on you. 
This is rather unfortunate. We're in the middle of a magical rite, and I left my sword in the stateroom. If I'm un if I'm unarmed, I'll just have to down here, Sir Pico. Yeah, just just get the hell up out of there. When Sir Pico gets serious, like he gets the lock, like because you, you see, like he like doesn't open his eyes and shit, like ever. When he dials in, it gets kind of serious though. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie. Can we skip whatever this is? Nope. No, we cannot. <sighs> nice one. Thank you, Isidro. The stateroom was just below us. We're close. Oh, God. Isidro. All right, cool. Guess he fell in the water. They're raiders. No doubt. Masters of infiltration. Remain vigilant. You know what's been really interesting is like... There's been no... There's been no puck jokes since the uh, since Elf Island got destroyed. There's no like puck, like puck is in regular elf form at all times now. It seems puck's like like not making any jokes or saying anything or looking like a Jedi master or dressed up as a war council or soldier or something like that. You know, because I feel like in a normal time like this, Isidro does something like that. Puck has a remark or something to say. You know, hmm. Interesting. I don't know if that's just like a, a writer's choice or that's being purposely done because maybe we'll get some Puck. Maybe Puck feels some type of way about what happened with Elf Island and all. I'm not sure. I'm not quite sure. The lock is. The window won't open. Oh my god. What are... Oh my god. I I understand they've never had they've never been in battle before, right? And Morda talks all this shit too, by the way. It's different when you're out there in action. You could talk all the smoke you want, but until like when people start pulling out the the blickies, you know, some people might freeze up. Um But everybody here in this picture You guys have abilities. You can do things. What are we and I know damn well old guru boy back there has abilities. What's happening? I know they said that like they're losing their magic, but we got nothing? Absolutely nothing? Oh man. Oh god. Are they purposely like blanking out their eyes like that? It's making me think they're not like fully human. It's not what it looks like. We were just discussing who takes next watch. Oh no, they've got people roped up too. What is this? Mutiny? Or an enemy attack? Either way, it seems God was watching and divine retribution for our deviousness has been swift. Look, are they trying to open the door? That's where the master in black locked himself in, right? <sighs> If he needs someone to, to to put his rage, go ahead and open that door. See how that shit goes. So they were in charge of watching Guts then. I'm assuming. No, they mustn't. If they open that door, the Black Swordsman will awaken. Why do they strip my man down like this? <laughs> Why do I gotta do him like that? Wasn't he? Oh no, he was stripped down before. Okay, I was about to say. He'll tear them limb from limb. Here's the thing. He could probably clear all of them out that have boarded the ship. Problem is, what does he become at that point? Will, he, will there be a Guts in there that won't be able to distinguish like who is he supposed to be attacking and who he's not? Who knows what that'll go through. Yes, it might help, but it might hurt at the same time. Oh, shit. They made that room so, like, deep and dark. They know what that is. They know who that is. Uh, no rage out this chapter, huh? Or maybe. I don't know what they're saying, too. Like, do they recognize who that is or what that is? 
This is not going to go good for them, I don't think. Yeah, see how they cut off of that? Yeah. Yeah, it's not going to go well. I'll say it again. I'm Roderick, captain of this ship. Let go. Crap. I do not know who you are, but hear this. I don't care what happened to us, what happens to us, but don't lay a finger on the women and children. Nobody speak. We don't have anybody that speaks, huh? Not one of you witches can train. I don't know why I'm asking. It's no use. I can't understand what they're saying, which has made me realize their unfamiliar tongue, their equipment. This lot are soldiers of the Kashan Empire. Doesn't help me understand what they're talking about, though. Kashan. Yeah, all y'all's worldly travels and nobody can, sp like, like, speak even... Oh, man. Captain, we're in the middle of the ocean, far from land. Surely the Kashan can't have expanded their reach to the waters of Is, or however you pronounce it. That would mean... It would mean that, having conquered Midland, they are now invading neighboring countries that kind of sustained advance would require the support of a powerful fleet the range of which in theory further expand in turn a kashan navy that's what i'm saying are the because we saw griffith talking about you know essentially making his like rainbow road <laughs> His little Mario Kart Rainbow Road that allows him to, like, you know, teleport troops and forces here, troops and forces here. You know, cavalry, supplies, yada, yada, yada. You know, wanting to expand what they could and take over. But there's no more, like, they, they don't know what, what's what's become out there, by the way. Like, what, like, how it's set up. You know, the world's been taken over and all that type of shit. But I don't think they know, like... That's what I'm saying. Unless these Kashan are acting independently, there's no more, like, Kashan... It's, you know, it's all under one, like, Falconia umbrella here. That's what I'm saying. I don't know if they're acting on their own, and they somehow have been surviving outside of Falconia. Or they are on orders and just happen to come across us. I don't know. We're not going to get that answer this chapter either, because I'm running out of pages. This isn't funny. <laughs> you mean the Kashan who attacked Vertranus that night picked up our trail? That has to be it. That night was also foggy, like tonight. They were frightful beasts. In fire, they set fire to the city. He, okay, everybody take a deep breath. The Kashan, their cruelty is legendary. There's no atrocity that's beyond them. We've been captured by cold-blooded savages. They'll kill us. He's right, but something's off. With a force of this size, they should have been able to simply wipe us out from the start. Yeah, I don't think they're of... I don't think they're... From Falconia. That's right. Magic. We have magic, don't we? Do something. Bro. For once, I'm with Farnese's brother. Yo, don't we? We would, but our powers vanished alongside Elf Island, and our staves have been taken. <laughs> to be honest with you, the island was still intact, and you had your staves when the shit was getting taken. So, I don't think it makes a difference. I don't think you'd be doing a damn thing. <sighs> Lord Magnifico, besides, we dislike conflict. Apologies. I'm almost to the point where I wish we just never stopped at Elf Island. <laughs> what was the point? <laughs> I am almost confident that give Shirka enough time, she could have accessed Casca's mind and somehow released it. Hmm. We're done for. This is just a bad dream. Do they have some other purpose here? I just can't think of what that would be. But I can safely say that we that we just might have Oh my god. <laughs> this man is about to go off. I repeat, he friend or foe. If you make eye contact, you will die. And this music that's playing right now is going crazy if they give us a guts full shot here. Unknowingly straight into a strange world. Trickert. Guts in, in chains in the midst of despair. The party's fate takes a turn. That's Rickert. I don't think that's Sonya or whatever. That's Rickert. But is 
Oh, I would have loved, like, so you see Guts' feet here, right? And if we'd have gotten a full panel there of him in rage mode having killed all those men that came after him. But they're saying Guts is in chains. So maybe he didn't go crazy. So what the hell is going on with Rickard here? Um, it's, it's either Rickard or Sonya. Honestly, you cover them both up from the eyes. Down, I've. Could be either one. Um, but I'm thinking to myself, if that actually is Rickard, then are these men... That, that's the biggest question right now. Maybe we get that in 375, maybe we don't. This Kashan force here, right? They haven't, at least to my knowledge, they haven't slaughtered or killed anyone. Oh, it is, it is, it is, it is, it is, it is, it is. Okay, look, 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 they're right here, 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 they're right here. Cool, 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 cool. This is them. Now, I don't know if this is Roderick thinking of like, oh, Kashan, and then thinking of them, the Baki Raka boys. Like that's what he pictures when he thinks of Kashan. Or are they showing us that this is who this this is who's rolled up on us right now? I'm just gonna go for the assumption that seeing them here in this panel here, and then seeing who I think is Rickert, that they're all in on it together. Now the question is, if they are all in on it together, like if these Kashan men are sailing under them under their command. Because didn't he say there was other, like, Kashan out there that were, like, refu like they're kind of living in their own towns, very kind of, like, rough, rugged, you know, the nasty of the nasty type shit that, you know, didn't join forces or doesn't believe with the Falconia, Griffith shit, and they're kind of out there, and that's who they were going to find and who they were going to stay with, right? Kind of because they were away from everything up in the mountains or whatever. Um, that's what I'm assuming this is. But then my question is, you know, if that's if that's what's happening right now and they went there, conquered them or leading them, whatever the question may be. Why does Rickert have to be here in quote unquote disguise, essentially? Like if you rolled up with us, like, can he not just sit back with them or does he have to be in disguise? Can he not be like a friendly face of like, hey, I speak English. <laughs> We're just looking for X, Y, Z. So for right now, until we get more information, which I only have one more chapter to get more information, I'm going to assume that this group of Kashan are under the Baki Raka's command. Like they went, Rickert, um, Erica, the old mage, and you know, these bodyguards here. I'm going to assume they found the Kashan out there that they were looking for. He's leading them, they're leading them, they're all working together. Um... And maybe they got a sense of, you know, something happened out there. Like a lot of magical power was lost. I don't know what their reason would be for being out here in the ocean right now in this specific spot. Other than if that old magic user felt something, sensed something when Elf Island got destroyed, XYZ. Regardless, I don't think anybody here is working for Griffith or working for Falconia or anything like that. I think they actually were purposely trying to find us or at least find Elf Island if this is what they came across. I just don't know why Rickards in disguise is the only question. Um, so that's what I'm going to assume. Because they haven't killed anybody. We haven't really seen any of that yet. They've just kind of taken everybody hostage. Um, nothing bad has happened yet. So I'm going to assume it's all going to be okay. Because um, it's interesting to say, like, oh, because when he's like, oh, Guts is in chains. But then we see this here with the guy bringing the chains. But then we see these chains kind of like breaking away here. So are these like the figurative chains that's like breaking off of like the wolf and Guts is just like fully just letting it happen? Or I don't know. Interesting, interesting questions here. But do they, are they doing this on purpose? Like no pupils for any of these guys? It makes me think like they're being controlled. Um, Who knows? Who knows? Guts is still going through it. It's not well. Nothing's going good. Everything's a mess. Um, I think the best shot we got were the, um, I mean, the Serpico in his Sunday best wasn't bad. <laughs> but I think the best shots we got were of um, Guts down here, just losing it. But I mean, like, what are the actual, like, it, and this is what I hope it is, Rickert's group and all that, and 
they were either coming to look for us or help us in some way or you know just come to elf island because that's where they heard we were searching for or whatever because if they are just out here just like fucking us up we can't catch a break and i mean cannot catch a break so i kind of like this shot here but i think the one i like the most is the parallel of because it just made me remember because I'm watching the Berserk anime right now of Griffith on the Sword. I think I kind of like that one. This one here as my shot of the uh, shot of the reaction. Can I pull that down a little bit? Perfect. Um, we have one chapter left. Yeah. <laughs> That is absolutely crazy for me. Like I said, we've been doing this for a year. Six plus, six to nine chapters a week. And that's just, just over? I remember when I was in like the, the teens and the 20s, I'm like, man, 374. I think I was at 371 is when I started. I was like, man, that's a long ways away. And in a year, you guys got four chapters? Yikes, that's insane. Um, so we'll see how it plays out. I'm so, so just distraught and disappointed in in elf island in the witches and the mages and the gurus and the elves and whatever not only did we like we get no help from them when push came to shove we still can get nothing from them and they're just gone i didn't know that essentially what how it was being stated at the beginning of this chapter um Everything essentially mythical there is connected to the world tree or what the spirit tree that was coming out of the the island And we just destroy that and that's it I don't know and then there's a lot of questions of Was that Griffith's goal like what happened To the island like was that Griffith's doing was it another like up? Oh, it's been another 10,000 years, you know, this event's going to happen. Was it Guts' is doing? Was it Griffith's doing? Was it both of their doing? I have absolutely no idea, but... Danon, star, flower, monarch, whatever, has got to be the biggest buildup correlated to the biggest bust, <laughs> the biggest non-help in the entire sh uh, story so far. So, I don't know. We'll leave it there and see how it goes, but we have one chapter left um i'm curious kind of where it's going to leave off um how long until chapter 376 i mean there's a lot of questions all i know is right now it seems really really hopeless like even the witches that we do have you know all their power comes from the island and the island's gone but my thing is like can they not just be trained up you're all of all of what you are is dependent on that island standing. And I guess you never think of like, okay, this place could be destroyed, but it almost makes me think even if the island was still intact and everything was fine, the farther that they get the farther they sail away, the farther they move away from the island, the less that you know, the less their powers are. Um I don't know. Shirka's a witch and she's got ability and didn't need all that, so maybe she can teach them something. I don't know. Shirka went from being like Okay, she's the only witch we know. She's pretty powerful. To being like, holy shit, Shirker's not even like top five, top ten wizard, mage, guru. To, okay, Shirker's number one. <laughs> she's literally all we have at the moment, so. I don't know. We'll leave it there and see. Appreciate it, everybody. Like, share, subscribe, and as always.